Namaste children. This is Manisha Segal from the Department of English and today I am going to talk skillfully and patiently all about adverbs. In this lesson, I am going to teach you all about adverbs. We will learn what are adverbs, what are its kind and how to identify an adverb in a sentence and tell its kind. So let us begin the topic. Now, first of all, I would like to ask, what do you mean by adverbs? Children, adverbs. We can simply learn that adverbs add to the meaning of verbs. Fine. So, if adverbs add to the meaning of verbs, now the question arises, what do you mean by verbs? Action words are called verbs. Let me quote an example. The children of class 7 danced. See to it. The students danced. Now danced is verb. Now let me add a verb to it. The students danced. Mary. So here a verb is Mary. How did the students dance? Mary. So adverb adds to the meaning of a verb. Fine. It modifies verb. But I must say adverbs are very talented words. Because they not only add to the meaning of verbs, there is more to it. An adverb is a verb that adds something to the meaning of a verb, an adjective or another adverb. So, adverb adds to the meaning of a verb, an adjective or another adverb. Let us learn this through examples. First example, they worked silently. How did they work? Silently. Fine. So, silently is adverb. How the action happened? They work silently. So, here verb is a verb. And silently is adverb. It's adding some information about verb. Now let us see the next, the next example. Vandana is very smart. Here Vandana is, let us take like this. Vandana is smart. Smart is adjective. What are adjectives? Adjectives modifies noun. Adjectives add to the meaning of noun. So here smart is adjective. Vandana is very smart. Very is adverb because here it is modifying adjective. So in the first sentence, adverb modified the verb, worked. And in the second sentence, adverb modified the word smart which is an adjective. Now let us see the third example. The child runs quite fast. How does the child run? Fast. Now run is a verb. And which word is answering to the question how? How does the child run? Fast. This is adverb. But there is one more word here. The child runs quite fast. So here quite is adverb. So here quite is adding to the word. Is modifying adverb. So, the, uh, so, through these three examples, we learn that adverbs add to the meaning of a verb, an adjective, or another adverb. Let me quote one more example. Samriti sang melodiously. How did Samriti sang? How did Samriti sing melodiously? Fine. Now, children, let us learn. Kinds of adverbs. Well, there are seven kinds of adverbs. I will be discussing here seven kinds of adverbs. Adverb of manner, adverb of place, adverb of time, adverb of degree, adverb of frequency, duration of adverb, adverb of duration and interrogative adverb. Now children, don't be, get confused after listening so many adverbs. It's very, very simple. 
Let's see. Answer the questions. All these adverb answers to some questions. Like adverb of manner answer the question, answers the question how. Fine. For example, the students worked. How did the students work? How did it will answer to the question how? The students work hard. So here word hard is an adverb. So adverb of manner answers the questions how. How did the students work? The students work hard. Well students of my class 7 are very diligent. Next, Kiran writes. So how does Kiran write? Neatly. So here adverb of manner is neatly. Fine. So I think you have understood that adverb of manner answers the question how. Like the students work hard. Kiran, knight, Kiran writes neatly. Next, adverb of place. Adverb of place answer the questions where. For example, the children are playing upstairs. So where are children playing? Upstairs. Let me quote another example. The teacher went outside. Where did the teacher go? Where? Outside. So it's very easy to identify adverb in a sentence. Adverb of place answers the question where. The children are playing upstairs. Where are children playing? Upstairs. The teacher went outside. Where did the teacher go? Outside. So here, upstairs and outside are adverbs. Next, adverb of time. Adverb of time answer the question when. For example, the result will be declared soon. When will be the result declared? Soon. It will answer to the question when. So here, soon is adverb of time. Next, adverb of degree. Adverb of degree answer to the question how much. For example, Ridhima is very pretty. How much pretty? Very. So here very is adverb of T. Next, adverb of frequency. Adverb of frequency answers to the question how often? How often? I called your name twice. How many times? Twice. Now my children got confused between adverb of degree and adverb of frequency. You have to keep in mind one thing. Adverb of degree answer to the question how much? And adverb of frequency answer to the question how often? For example, I almost fell. How much? Almost. And frequency how often? I always speak truth. How many times? Always. Next, adverb of duration answers to the question how long. Neha stopped briefly to meet her friend. For how long? Briefly. Next, interrogative adverb. Interrogative adverb ask a question. How do you go to school? So here the word how is an adverb of, is an interrogative adverb. So students, let us recapitulate what we have learned today. We have learned that adverbs, an adverb is a word that adds something to the meaning of a verb, an adjective or another adverb. And we have learned seven kinds of adverbs, adverb of manner, adverb of place, adverb of time, adverb of degree, adverb of frequency, adverb of duration and interrogative adverb. I hope you enjoyed this lecture.